We need your help collecting 100,000 toys for children in our area. This year, WLKY is a proud partner of Toys for Tots. Jennifer Bayless is live at the Toys R Us on Shelbyville Road to kick off our toy drive. Are you getting any toys, Jennifer? Yeah, for sure. People are already dropping off toys in our donation bins here. Now, all month long, you can donate new unwrapped toys like these uh, in these bins, these Toys for Tots bins that will be uh, set up across our area here at Toys R Us, other Toys R Us locations across the area, and at our studios, 1918 Melwood Avenue. Now, last year, the community collected more than 67,000 toys for Toys for Tots just in our area. Now, that serviced and brought Christmas to more than 18,000 children. We want to boost that goal to 100,000 toys this year. Now, we know you can do it. WLKY needs your help, though. We are going to host our own toy drive next Tuesday, November 11th, all day at our studio's 1918 Melwood Avenue. Now, if you're thinking, I don't really know what to buy or donate anything, any kind of toy. Just think about when you were a child. Things like crayons, figurines, dolls, and it doesn't have to be expensive. You don't have to spend a lot of money to help a child uh, in need have a good Christmas. So again, look for these Toys for Tots bins. You can pretty much purchase any kind of toy that you would like. Um, they are asking that you do not donate any kind of weapon toy, no toy gun. They will not be handing those out. No food, no candy, just regular toys like these right here. Uh, and we do have more information about Toys for Tots. If you would like to uh, possibly sign up to receive toys or maybe make a monetary donation, you can go to our website, WLKY.com. For now, reporting live in St. Matthews, Jennifer Bayless, WLKY News.